blue jeans. It's pink. But also, these are not the jeans that I packed for this outfit. And so I'm trying to decide if I even like them. I brought like a lower rise, like baggier fit, like light wash Levi's to wear with this. And I'm also trying to decide between these earrings or or just these earrings and also it's 80 degrees so i feel like even though this is like all open i feel like i'm gonna be hot because it's so thick but i don't know for right now i'm gonna ask my boyfriend what he thinks but for right now this is this is my outfit so yeah So I changed to this shirt because I'm like, you know, I feel like it'll just, I'll be a lot um, cooler. And I'm like, it still goes because it has like, you know, pink in it and I have, you know, pink on my jeans. So I'm like, okay. And then I was like, but something is just like missing. So I was like, oh, I forgot I brought these earrings. Like, it's hard to tell in here. Hold on, let me show y'all. So I'm like, oh yeah, that gives it like an extra um Tell me why I was putting the other one on and I dropped it. Bro, it broke. I have no glue. And I'm so mad because I feel like that just really completed it. Like, see, oh, oh my gosh. I'm so mad. These were expensive too at Urban Outfitters. I'm just gonna wear these instead, but you're not really gonna see them anyway, but they still, I'm still mad. I guess either these or um, probably my Margellas. skins obviously i have on these vc jeans because i didn't end up wearing these jeans yesterday I, I ended up wearing a whole different outfit that was probably my cutest outfit and i didn't get to show y'all but anyway i'm wearing these today then and i'm gonna wear my jordan ones so i've been thirsty to wear these and then this ghani bag which is so cute i got it from essence so yeah very simple, but, but cute. Okay, bye. I don't know, I'm trying to decide. These are just so cute, but then like, these Vivian Westwood ones, oh, are so cute too. 
I don't know. I think I might do the dangly ones. Yeah. Okay. Bye. <laughs>right now but i have got to show y'all these um things that i got from publix girl these are amazing so like you know the thomas brand um i feel like you usually get like the um the cinnamon raisin um i forget what they are but anyway whatever it doesn't matter they have the muffin tops okay i love blueberry muffins but like i never can finish the whole thing excuse me and then like the tops are just so good and they have just the top. It's so nice because it's packaged individually. And it's like literally the muffin top. Look, you can even see. Wow, these are so good. Shout out to Thomas. Sponsor me if you'd like because I'm obsessed. What's up, y'all? I just came on here to wrap up the video. And I also like wanted to check in and see like how you guys are feeling like at the, now that it's like, you know, the end of the year, the year is closing up. Because me personally, I feel like it's stressful for me. I feel like... 
yeah i don't know i i know a lot of people like the end of the year because it's like oh winding down and stuff but i feel that the end of the year is kind of stressful for me because it's like you know that's when people are buying stuff so i need to be making stuff i need to have items up i need to be you know producing like the end of the year is like crunch time for me and then also it's like the stress of like finding a flight to go back home and it's like home is so far so it's like expensive because i'm gonna be gone in ohio for like eight days and when i think about that it stresses me out because i'm like oh my gosh that's eight days i'm not gonna be making any money like that's so stressful to me and that's that's one thing i actually wanted to mention is like when people are like so wanting to be entre entrepreneurs so badly it's like I don't want to say why because obviously there's tons of pros to it but like it is so stressful sometimes like in my case it's like okay I have to shut the store down because I can't um I can't ship you know I can't bring all of my items here all of my inventory all the way to Ohio to be able to ship stuff out and I have a certain amount of days that I need to ship things so it's like I have to shut the store down because I'm not gonna be here to ship the stuff and so then I just think like, dang, and this is like the season where people are buying stuff. So I'm going to be missing out on money. And it's like, I don't know. I like being home because I know, because I'm making money at home. You know what I mean? But then also the end of the year, I'm always like, I kind of hurry, I kind of like wanted to hurry up and like start the new year so that I can like not spend any money and like just be focused on different projects and stuff that I want to do. Um, but yeah. I'm just rambling now because I don't know. I don't never talk to y'all. Oh, oh, one more thing before I go. I also wanted to say thank you to all y'all who have um, messaged me on Instagram and and said um, and made comments on like me being consistent on here because y'all I have been trying. Okay, I know in the past like I'll do it a little bit and then I just like fall completely off, completely off for like a year. But I've been feeling motivated and I've been like enjoying it again and like especially like just the editing and stuff. So. Thank you guys for noticing. I'm really, really grateful. And thank you guys for watching. Um, so yeah, if you're not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below. And um, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.